Hello, and welcome to Token Registration for Business Online Banking at Heritage Bank. My name is Ashley Tholo, and I am a Deposit Implementation Specialist here at Heritage Bank. You can see on your screen we have technical and customer service support listed there. And these numbers and email address will be given at the end of the presentation as well. Some general information about your token. Tokens are assigned by the bank. Tokens will be provided to your business by someone from our implementation team. Tokens are required for all users who will use ACH, wire, remote deposit, or positive pay services within online banking. Tokens are needed each and every time you log into online banking. This is true whether you are using online banking version from your computer or if you're logging into our business mobile app. Tokens should be stored in a safe and secure location and not used by anybody other than who they're assigned to. If a token stops working for any reason or you lose your token, be sure to contact us right away. We'll turn the token off and issue a replacement. If a specific user or the business is no longer in need of the token, please return it to the bank. Now, using the token registration handout we supplied to you, we will register a token in online banking. Go to www.heritagebanksna.com, and over on the right-hand side where it says log into your account, you're going to select the radio button next to business, enter your bank assigned access ID, and click submit. It's going to ask for a password. This password is supplied by the bank and is a temporary first-time user password. It will be very generic. It'll bring you to a screen to change your password. You will enter in that generic password again. And then for your new password, since the token replaces a password going forward, we suggest just switching the password around and entering it in backwards. You'll get to the security registration screen. The first one is token serial number. This number here is on the back of your token that was provided to you and you will enter in the numbers on the back without dashes. One-time password, click the gray button on the front of the token to get an eight-digit number. Enter that number in here. You will then create a unique four-digit PIN number that you will know only this four-digit number will be used as an extension to your token number each and every time you log in. So be sure to select a PIN you will remember. If your email address, security question and answer did not flood in, please enter those now and then click Submit. To confirm that your token has successfully been registered, we suggest testing logging in with your token. So click Log Out, which will bring you back to the home screen. Click on the radio button, Business, enter in your access ID, username, click Submit, click the gray button on your token, enter that number in, and then your four-digit PIN number behind it. So your total password will be 12 digits in length. Click Log In. You'll see a site authentication value. Press the gray button on your token once more, and the number on the token should be the same number you see on your screen. If it is, go ahead and hit OK to launch you into the site. If it is not, click Cancel and log completely out. Contact us right away. A successful login will bring you to your home page of online banking. Here you can navigate as needed. Thank you for watching our token registration video. If you have any questions or need assistance, please contact us at the email address or the telephone numbers below. Our mailing address is listed there for you as well. Thanks again, and have a great day.